what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? 22-year-old Andrea Ivanova from Bulgaria has the world's largest lips. She recently underwent surgery for her 20th injection and she wants more. This woman is obsessed with big lips. So, it is reported that she has spent thousands of dollars on these injections and it cost her, they said, somewhere in the neighborhood of 75 bucks a pop. That The math don't really add up there, but I'm just going by the report. In any event, it doesn't even matter what it cost. The bottom line is, this is insane. It's, it's really sad that so many young people will go to any length to make their body parts disproportionate. It's crazy. And you look at the picture of the woman prior to the surgery. And I mean, prior to the first surgery. And she's easy on the eyes. But now, oh man. I don't understand what people be looking at when they look into the mirror and they go for that look. I don't understand it. Even now, you know, you got women who go, go overboard with the breast implants or the butt injections and, and implants. And then they're going back into the hospital uh, to try to get those things reduced and get stuff, those objects pulled out of them. I can understand a person wanting to improve their look for them. I get it. But so often, I really do believe some of these people are doing this stuff for others. And then you got people that are doing it for attention. That's the other thing. And I think that's what she's doing. But I just don't understand, like, she was already getting attention. She was an attractive girl. But I guess she wanted that world record attention, that viral attention, because she's probably one of a kind. That is insane. I think that people who get plastic surgery should undergo a psychological evaluation prior to any type of surgery being performed. And I think that doctors who perform surgery, like excessive surgeries on people, who take advantage of these people that are in these like bad state of mind, I think that they should be done with. I don't think that they should practice. At the very least, they should be put on probation, given some type of a fine. Because these doctors have to take some type of accountability also. This is ridiculous, family. This woman has to walk around every day of her life looking like that. And it's almost like everybody see that it's a bad idea, but her. I don't get it. Having said all that, it doesn't matter what I or the rest of the world thinks about her lips. She has to live with that. She has to look into the mirror every day and see those lips. If she like it, I love it. Nah, nah, I don't love it. But if she like it, 
That's all that really matters. Still, I can't help but think, perhaps she hadn't had an opportunity to hear Dove's slogan. Love the skin you're in. No more talk. What, what, what the haters talking about?